after us. Oh crap. We're under attack. Get him, grab your gun. Welcome to Tennessee. Hello, my brothers and sisters out there in YouTube land. Out here at the Cherokee Lake. She is beautiful. Gonna be doing an overnight canoe trip. There's some strange guy following me. If we sneak up real quietly, we may be able to get some video uh, evidence of him. Be very, very quiet. Hey, Scott. Hey, Adam. Me and Scott out on a little fishing trip. He was nice enough to invite me along. Uh, we're taking his canoe. Got the gear, about to load up and get in the water. Appreciate you inviting me out. Oh man, I'm, we're gonna have fun. Let's do this. Well, we made it out on the water. And uh, check out this beautiful view. She is gorgeous, that's for sure. This one's for Bill Gowdy. Adam Raven, checking in. Cheers, brother. It's not in a bottle. <laughs> it's not in a bottle, but hey, beggars can't be choosers. You got me paddling now. So I'm taking a break, letting Scott paddle a little bit so he can carry his own weight. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry, I can't say that with a straight face. No, he's been doing a good job. We're about to come around this bend up here. Basically got another, what, mile and a half? I don't know. Oh. Yeah, we'll call it a mile and a half. We should be at Maybe camp. another two miles, I don't know. Could be 12. Huh? <laughs> it could be 12. <laughs> <laughs> That's a good one. Uh-oh, we got a fish. Fish oh. on. That's a good one. Oh, can Scott pull it off? That's the question. Oh. Holy crap, it's oh. a catfish. That's a catfish. That is a big cat. Wow. Check it. Eat, eat it up, Steve Sharon. Eat that it up. That is beautiful. Check it out. We got dinner for tonight. Check out that cat. <laughs> oh, I better get him before he gets up. Oh, crap. He's fighting some more. I got to go, y'all. He's a beast. He's a fighter. Check Look out this beast. Check that out. Eat your heart out, Steve Sharon. You better watch Adam's video. <laughs> <laughs> Good job. Crap. Oh, crap. So now what are you going to do with him? We're going to eat him. No, I mean, how are you going to store him? I've got, I've got some, uh, some paracord. We'll uh, make a... I've got some in my bag right here. We'll awesome. make a stringer out of it and strap him onto the side of the boat. Like a balls. Well, three times in a row, I lost a worm. So, I'm taking a little break from fishing. Just enjoying it. It is rather beautiful out here at the moment. And Scott was enjoying it too. He had that smug smirk on his face from catching that catfish. <laughs> He's got to catch a big one, y'all. He's got to. <laughs> We're not going back home until he catches a big one. Bigger than mine. We may be here a while. Yeah. <laughs> okay, let, let's put another worm on there. <laughs> well, we are coming up on camp for the evening. 2.36 miles. 2.36 miles. Yeah, it's not bad at all. Yeah, it's not so bad. And then we can, we got all this area right here to fish in. And if you look straight ahead, this is the area where me, Roger, and Christy were, and my wife and Christy's brother Curtis on Memorial Day. So I was wanting to sh give y'all a good close up view of this monster catfish. Check this beast out. She is gorgeous. That is our dinner tonight, thanks to Scott. Good job, brother. I got lucky. I wish it had been Adam, really. We have camp set up. Got my normal hammock set up. It's 
Scott's got his setup over here. What kind of setup are you using? Yeah, this is just a Sam's Club castaway hammock. <laughs> It's a double nest. This is the Hennessy snake skins with the Noah Kelty, the Kelty Noah 12 tarp. That was actually given to me by another YouTuber that doesn't even film. Really? Yeah, his name was Ramble On. Nice. I thought that was really nice of him. Yeah, so 12 foot is good if you're a little taller, usually over 6 foot. The only downside to having a tarp that's a little over 11 foot is it makes it a little harder to find trees to space them apart to find a good area for it. That's not even bending notes or anything. Well, we're trying to get some wood together to uh, cook the catfish tonight, but we found some excellent fat wood check this out that is some beautiful that is some purdy fat wood look at that side view it just glistens that is some really good fat wood but this bad boy is coming home with me I got some more fat wood to start the fire with for those that do not know do not ever cook your food on pine because it has turpentine in it and if you cook it, the fumes will get into your food and it could make you sick amongst some other stuff that's very unpleasant. Hey Jax, came across this mushroom. Haven't ever seen one like it before. Thought maybe you might know what it is. We're gathering up uh, some hardwood to cook on for tonight. We'll be starting our live stream here in about an hour. Scott's back there helping as well. Oh crap, he's got a big log now. So we were just chilling here in yeah. camp, and all of a sudden we got a surprise. Let me, let me show you firsthand what happened. I mean, oh crap, we're under attack! Get him, grab your gun! Who is that up there? Well, we got a surprise visitor, it looks like. Let's go check it out. 